we're really excited for Texas and uh, their staff sent a video of their celebration when we won uh, the match point in USC. So uh, we're all about the Big 12 right now and hoping that we can uh, play one more time. Then our uh, enthusiasm, our allegiance for their success would end pretty abruptly. But uh, uh, it's, it's two Big 10, two Big 12 uh, schools that have had great years. So, and Nebraska's probably playing as well as anybody in the country right now. So it'll be a, a great opportunity for our team. And we know it'll be a great challenge. Yeah, yeah. Four teams from the central time zone, sure. which is exciting. Uh, and I think that speaks to the, uh, the uh, parity across the entire country. And I, I'm sure it's been a long time since there's been a, uh, hasn't been a Pac-12 team in this, uh, in this event. But uh, we're thrilled to be part of it. Uh, we're thrilled that the, the Midwest uh, is holding their end of the deal as far as uh, teams represented. And we're excited it's at a neutral site, you know, uh, the Jayhawk fans. We got 200 tickets like every other team did, so I'm sure it'll be a nice neutral site uh, <laughs> other than those other 16,000 tickets that were uh, picked up properly by the, the Husker fans. But it's the type of environment that really we need for our, this event and for our sport. And I'm sure it'll, it'll captivate a lot of people, and I, I'm sure our team will be excited to be a part of it. We, uh, we played well. When, when there's more stimulus in the gym, it seems like our team has responded well to that, but we haven't necessarily been in that situation before so it's hard to say but um, our preparation and our planning will stay the same and I think um, that that uh, will provide some opportunity for our kids to really get excited and get some adrenaline. You know I point to the the trip we took in May uh, the foreign trip we took in May where they spent a ton of time together and the thing that really got us the staff pretty excited is each and every day you saw different uh, Jayhawks hanging out with different Jayhawks so It wasn't the same two eating breakfast together or doing their little sightseeing. It was different Jayhawks all the time. We changed the rooming list as, uh, as we went through the trip. And I think that trip had great value, not only playing at a competitive level, uh, but also to the team chemistry and how uh, we accept each other for who we are and we know how to get the best out of each other. Well, I think this team has never played Nebraska, so that's a, that's a good thing. And I don't think all of those are on me. There were some coaches before me. But I think that speaks to the excellence that Nebraska has been. It, 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 it speaks to uh, some, maybe some frustration over the years uh, on our part, too. But I think it speaks more to a team that year after year won the Big 12, the old Big 8, and it, into the Big 12. They've been to as many Final Fours as anybody, probably, at, in, in the current, current state. And... Um, I think that speaks to a program that's played at such a high level. And you could probably check some other records around the league, too, and they'd probably be similar. Uh, we've just had a hard time competing with, with them over the years on a consistent basis. Mm -hmm.